Hello, folks. Welcome again to another episode of the, the Hobo and Oh, me, yeah, I guess. Hobo and Girlfriend Wrestling Show. I will change that one day. But I have a question for everyone out there. Are you ready? I said, are you ready? Are you ready? Free product placement. I don't care. I have my kickstart. I actually woke up nice and late. That's why I saw my glasses on. But tonight's the night of Wrestle Kingdom. I think Wrestle Kingdom 13. I forget. I just know Wrestle Kingdom 11 was the Curse Fest. What's that Wrestle Kingdom 10? <laughs> I forget now. I forget. I honestly forget it's Wrestle Kingdom. All I know it's, well, in I think 12 hours, it's going to be day one of Wrestle Kingdom. And I was trying to figure out time zone differences and when, when things go. So I'm going to give a two-part predictions. Um, so let's see here. And I still have so much stuff to do. So this is for Russell Kingdom. Oh, I have some shoutouts to give. Jay Day, thank you very much for your comment. Yes, I think they're going back to the parking back to the olden days of the terrible part of the I forget it. It's when they did all the prawn panties matches though. When they just had hot lesbian action. So you, sir, are Definitely watching this on a forklift because you saw a luchador on a forklift. And then Christine Jordan, thank you very much for your comment. I actually did thoroughly enjoy it. Um, again, if you want to read my video, let's see what Matt says. Yeah, that sounds about right. Seven a.m. Sounds right. From last year. Monday will suck. The, will suck. Uh -oh. Yeah, because even WooTube. WooTube said. See you in 12 hours. Yours. So, but I'm not here to say that. I'm not here to promote probably terrible stuff for your body that makes makes you stay up all night. But oh wait, where, where was I? Christine Jordan. Jordan. So just like Jordan Grace, Christine Jordan, you got back too. Oh my God. Becky, look at her butt. Wow. I like big butts and I cannot lie.
So enough of that. Let's get into at least day one predictions, because I have no clue. Be tonight into tomorrow, tomorrow into Sunday. Yes! Oh, wow. So what's going to happen? This will this will be my day one. I'll post my day. Well, I have plenty of time to make my day two. Yes, is later. So I'll do this in two parts. So this is part uno of dos. Zero. Miedo. Bien, bien, bien. Let's talk about some Russell Kingdom. Now that my shout are over. See here, um, I have no idea who these people are. I just, I just took a guess. It's going to be friends of, of Jushin Thunder Liger versus the enemies of Jushin Thunder Liger. The heels against Jushin Thunder Liger. And I have Liger and friends winning, but there's going to be a bonus. Minoru Suzuki is going to make a run in. That's the bonus! And then the next match, I think... See, this is the only thing I don't like about New Japan is they just have, like, factions, like, do gang warfare in the ring. Because it's Los Ingomerales de Japan! Taking on Suzuki Goon. I have Lij winning. I think as a double bonus. Zack Saber Jr. is going to somewhat turn on Suzuki on Minoru Suzuki. That's my double bonus. And unfortunately, that one, I'm going to take a nap through. I have no idea who's in LIJ. All I know is that it's Suzuki, Minoru Suzuki, and Zack Sabre Jr. are in Suzuki Goon. That's my cat nap. Then we have Chaos versus Bullet Club. I think Yano's in Chaos. and But I don't know who the leader of Chaos is. Because at least I know Suzuki Goon's in charge of... Or Minoru Suzuki is in charge of Suzuki Goon. Naito, Tetsuya Naito is in charge of LIJ. I think. Chaos? It's just chaos. And Bullet Club for life. Their leader is Jay White. Switchblade. Oh, you know what? I'm wearing my Bullet Club shirt. I'm just going to say Bullet Club wins. I have no idea. Then we have uh, Fit Finley Jr. Take and Juice Robinson taking on the Gorillas of Destiny, Destiny, Destiny. I hope they come out to their Bullet Club feet. I don't know. I want to know how often they curse in this match. That's really it. I have the Grills of Destiny winning. I don't see Juice Robinson. I don't know. He's had his push, but he's still that really good mid Carter though. Yeah. G.O.D. wins. The Gorillas of Destiny. Tama Tonga and Tonga Loa. Then we have Lance Archer taking on John Moxley. I think that's for the U.S. title because that was vacated by Moxley. I think John Moxley is going to get that back. Uh, John Moxley wins. That will probably be a pretty good ma match. Uh, and then we have Will Ospreay versus Takahashi. I think this is the ticking time bomb. Takahashi. I honestly forget, though. There are like three or four Takahashis, and I was going to confuse. I have the ticking time bomb winning. Uh, he's making his return. Daryl's going to be there. 
Where was my live version of Daryl? No, oh, she's was out somewhere. She's gonna be super confused tonight. In fact, I'm gonna be super confused tonight. At least I have video games from midnight ish till two, because it won't take that long. Yeah, I have plenty of stuff to do at least. And then we get into the big stuff. We have Jay White taking on Tetsuya Naito. Let's see, I have to do that. Tetsuya Naito. I don't know, that weird thing he does with his eye. I have to take my glasses off for that, though. And yeah, that's my alarm going off, because I said it. I just kept on hitting the snooze button. Terrible to but I have Tetsuya Naito winning the IC. Yeah, I think. I forget if he's. Yeah, he's going to keep. I don't know. I haven't followed New Japan in a while. They've been threatening to take New Japan off US TV. In fact, I think it is coming off US TV eventually. So the only time I get to see it are weird days that I get to stay up way too late and go to sleep. Like, it's some weird hour of the morning when most people wake up. That's, that's really the only problem with New Japan Pro Wrestling. Unless I come to the States, it's like, do I really want to stay up till 3 a.m.? No, I have to work. Work's more important because that's what I actually get paid for. Until YouTube monetizes me, which will probably be never. <laughs> I don't think they're coming, but who knows. But the see United and women win, uh, winning... And this is my stone cold lock. And then in the main event of the evening, we have the challenger in this corner, Kota Ibushi, taking on. In this corner, I just know him as Okada for the New Japan, for the IWGP Heavyweight Championship. And I'll tell you what, I have Okada winning, and I'll give you my reasons why after I make this, this major announcement as this being the match of the night. I will kind of wing this because from what I've heard on day two, which I guess is Saturday into Sunday, and that's fine because I don't work until seven, so I'm good with that. Um, this sets up Tetsuya Naito taking on Okada at the champion versus champion match, which I've heard I think is going to happen day two of Wrestle Kingdom. So that's the reason why I have my picks. I have no idea, though. I could be totally wrong. I could be perfect as far as I know. Um, and that's my Wrestle Kingdom Part 1 predictions. Part 2 predictions <laughs> will probably show up in, let's see here. So that's 12. 12 plus 5 in about 17 more hours. So we'll see what happens then. Um, or maybe even later tonight. Depends how much free time I have. And can actually figure out stuff. So with all that being said and done, check out my part two Russell Kingdom prediction. It's probably airing later. And again, be like Jay Tay and Christine Jordan. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and you too can get your video shout out. Or if you're like Little Fettuccini, Bump Slicks, and Ben Blaze, comment often enough and you become a character in the Daytona Beach Bump Fight League. Uh, wrestling, which I still have to make. I still have a lot to do. Everyone have a good night. Bye.